ex-basketball player, assistant coach uh, in the NBA, and uh, you talked about career paths. You know, you never know what career path you're going to take, but you do know one thing: if you don't get a good education, you don't keep your grades up, you don't work at it. You don't get a chance to have an opportunity to do any of these things. You know, as a young individual, you know, you need to realize when you're young that you need to have a good reading skills, writing skills, and just communication skills. You know, because at some time in your life, you're going to be doing something besides a sport, you know, and, and lots of times when you get older, you, re you see it now, but when you're younger, you don't see it. But that's why the young guys, you know, I would tell you the, f the main thing is to stick to the grades, work on your sport. If you, just, if you play a sport, you know, just work hard, but always remember, you know, you got to have good grades. And the thing that I, that I learned once I went to Michigan, you know, I, I had a great education from there and I could go anywhere. If I didn't even make it in basketball, I'd have a diploma that they can never take from me. They took my basketball, but they can't take my diploma from me. I'm assistant coach. I've been coaching the NBA for 12 years. Uh, I really enjoy my job. I enjoy developing players. Winning is definitely one of the things you want to do, but you know, you always can't win, but you know, you have to be a good sport about it. But uh, the thing about coaching is, I never thought I'd get into coaching, but uh, as, as much as I love basketball, that was an opportunity for me to stay in the game. And that's why I enjoy coaching so much.